Hi, welcome back. For a project I need some nails and this is a farmhouse style vintage project so these wire nails you can buy in hardware stores or even screws are not the right solution as it won't fit the style. So what I found out is how to very easily give nails a handcrafted look and still maintain the advantages of modern standardized nails. My name is Heiko, welcome to the channel. First thing we need is a nail, you won't believe. Um, <laughs> yeah, a nail, wire nail, most of you guys have them at home. Um, or you can go to the hardware store, grab the length and the thickness you need. Or if they are too long, you can easily cut it and give it a new tip for the um, project you want to build. So what I did is, as I work a lot with single-use pellets, if I uh, claim the wood, I cut the wood and very often I'm left with the corner posts. There are straight nails in it. If you try to remove the nails, you will bend it. That's not worth uh, the effort. But if you have this corner post and there are nails in it and you want to make a garden fire in the summer or as I do, I heat the house uh, partially with this wood, you are left with ashes and nails. And it is very easy to remove the nails from the ashes, clean them and use them. That's not the way if you really want to build a house. But if you need 10 to 20 nails, that's the way because every single pellet have a different kind of nail. So they all look a little bit different and that makes the job easier to make them look individual afterwards. So easy way, you can do that or you can go to the hardware store. Both will work. I show you what I did and you can adapt. Or Adopt, adapt, adapt, modify. You can just modify. Alright, this is now how our nails turned out. As a comparison I put you one industrial nail into the picture so that you can directly compare. And I think that the cooking in vinegar really gives the nails uh, their final touch. This is the end of the project so if you have any comments let me know and uh, yeah, click subscribe to the channel if you like and give me a thumbs up. I hope I see you soon. Happy crafting!